What's going on, silencers, and welcome to a uh, a demo, actually, for a game called Pathless Woods. This is a prologue, obviously. And if you do enjoy the content, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, all those fun things. And thank you ever so much to my patrons who have given me this paradise uh, that I get to explore. But without any further ado, let's get into it. Hey, wake up. What is this place? Drag your mouse to move the camera around. Okay. Finally come to your senses. Hurry up this way. I'm waiting for you ahead. WASD to move. Space to jump. Oh, and... We have a stamina bar right next to our... Um... Character. Hold shift to run. Uh, E to open doors. And what's this? Uh, you're not in good shape. Grab a bite to eat and keep yourself hydrated. Replenish your satiety and hydration to 70% or above. The lower the satiety, the hungrier you are. You'll keep losing HP when you're hungry. And uh, you'll lose HP when dehydrated. Okay. So pull up a yam. Pull up radish. Ooh, that's a daikon. So, eat. We'll eat the other one. And we'll eat the daikon. And then, yeah. Uh, to quickly use an item from your... Uh, to use an item from your inventory quickly, press the corresponding number key. Hey, it's a good thing I've played these kind of games before. Drink it upon to restore hydration. Oh, and that restores everything. I love it. Seems like that would be a smart thing. You just drink your fill from the get-go. Let's uh, uh, need a corresponding key, my ass. The key to the store must have been dropped nearby. Look around to search for it. Okay. I wonder if this is more a survival game or like a... Um, uh, adventure game. Or maybe somewhere in between. Maybe? I don't know. What's this over here? A hold F to pick up all the items. Okay. And then can I? Nope. And punch it all I want. Doesn't work. Hold F to pick up all the items. Oh, I need physique to lift certain things. You need wood, stones, and a straw rope to craft an ax. Straw ropes can be crafted with common rush. Um, but I don't have an, 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 any, uh, got it. Okay. I'll pick up a couple more of those and then not see Z Z. There we go. Craft that one. Perfect. Now. Craft an axe to pass the overgrown trees. I'm going to grab a few more of these because you never know. And uh, if you're anything like me, you're going to find out the hard way. And there's some wood. And Z to craft that. Perfect. And we're going to put that in slot number one. It looks like it has durability. Oh, it's a quick time event. Cool. I like that. You can just fell it by chopping or you can do the quick time event. I don't know what that was, but I'll take it. I like the addition of quick time events. That's actually kind of a nice, um, nice bit. Okay, pick up all those. Wonder if there's a benefit to the quick time events, like if you can get more materials. Excellent. Now keep moving. I'm gonna need a uh, pickaxe now. Darn. Uh, wooden hut. Ah, wooden hut. Uh, what's this? 
Perform an attack in the direction of your mouse cursor. Uh, okay. Pick up everything. Thank you. I got a key, which will open this door most definitely. Equip a bag and press B to open it. So pick it up. Press B. And there is a pickaxe. And we will just put all of our other bits in here. Why not? And now we've got a pickaxe, so let's run over here and choppity chop chop. Cool. I think I even got some like ore or something. Uh I? E? What's that? Copper ore. I'll be damned. And yeah, pick all that up. And in addition to opening the bag, pressing F1 can directly toggle the cursor on and off. Okay, cool. Press F1 to show the cursor and drag an item into the slot to drop it. So do that, do that. Okay, That's pretty much what I expected. Uh, press R to lock onto the nearest target. That can be attacked. And there is no quick time attack for. Um, there's no quick time attack for. <laughs> quick time event for attacking. Jesus. Double tap. Uh, oh, okay. So, what was it? Press R. And then. Okay. You have to. Double chat chip. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. And we can cancel that. And oh, oh, we got a uh, enemy. You're finally here. I'm the omnipotent and peerless guardian of the land. You must have been waiting for a long time. Continue. Uh, you have proven your worthiness by making your way here. I can get you out of this place, but you'll have to offer me one portion of food first. Give him whatever the fuck you want. Uh. E? Um, oh shit. I didn't mean to attack him. Uh, mushroom. Okay, so. When an item is selected, go four. Give. Now I feel much better. Uh, what the hell are you? Consider yourself lucky to see my true form. I'll now ask, escort you out of here as promised. The heaven and earth open my way. The lightning, lightning and clouds be my carriage. Go. Did he just eat me? All right. I'll bite. Uh... Yeah, we'll just create a, a new world and go from there. Uh, sure. I will be, uh, Liang Ping. Yeah. All right, here we are in uh, Pathless World. At least I think that's what it's called. Jeez, I've forgotten. I just started. A safe arrival, a safe arrival. You would have been stuck back there for the rest of your life if I didn't help you. What is this place? I was going to take you out, but I caught wind of your burning desire, so I brought you here instead. Rest assured you've landed in the right spot. I've chosen a safe haven to touch down. Take a gander at your surroundings for the time being. 
collect some straw mushrooms, okay? So we'll grab these straw mushrooms. There we go. And then now what? Uh, seems quite safe around here. We can also find food. Let's take a break and then we can go explore. So more mushroom. And then I need to craft armor. So wooden armor needs twigs, straw rope, and we need tools. And Oh, this is fun. Uh, let's craft a flint knife. Or whatever that's going to be. Pull up. Harvest. Huh. Okay, the um the knife makes it easy to uh to harvest things. Uh at least in theory. Because it makes it so that the rush will grow back, I think, maybe. Because it's leaving the roots intact. So let's grab all those. Let's grab some of these yams. Give us a little bit of uh, satiation. And then get all the wood scraps. Pick those up. Pick up the bonfire logs. Uh, oh, okay. So if we open this up, we add some wood chips. Okay. And then we put in a piece of chicken meat. And oh, it's automatically cooking. Okay, I, I was trying to figure out how to light the damn thing. Uh, Give it a second and we'll have a cooked uh, roasted chicken. Sorry. So we can eat eat. Ah, a chi of barbecue. I'm sorry, that just gave me like energy. Ah, that's pretty awesome. Fire click on fire can't be harvested. Okay. I don't need. Actually. Craft one of those. What's this need? This needs two straw ropes. Grass sandals. Um. Yeah, sure. We'll craft those. And that gave us something there. Cool. This is actually really cool. Um, let's get some more common rush. Like I said before, this game is uh, this is just a demo, so we're not seeing anywhere near the breadth of the um of the game we need twigs wood small rope but we also need not that we need a stone axe which requires a straw rope and ah son of a craft this thing craft this thing there so now we have 15 extra slots and um, let's see. Open the bag. We'll grab this, put it here. Grab this, put it here. Now, if I put stuff in the... Oh, no, no. Pick it all up. If I put stuff in the straw bag, like this, does it still show... What is that? Flint? Does it still show in my inventory if I'm, like, crafting and stuff? Yes, it does. Okay, cool. So we need twigs and some more straw rope. We're out of rush, so let's get some more of that. Uh, harvest. Does it also give us more materials when we harvest like that? It's a bit too warm. Dude, I don't know what to do about your temperature. Like, I ain't quite there yet. We need to craft wooden armor for Pete's sake. Uh, but I should be able to chop down a tree or two, so... So we got that and a twig. There we go. Pick up all that. Do we have enough twigs? Oh, uh, pick up that. Uh, we do. Now we just need... 
Batch craft. Eh, batch craft. Four of them. That'll happen real quick. We also need to make a hammer and yeah. Craft. Oh, it needs a workbench. My bad. Uh, how do I... How do I... <laughs> How do I build a workbench? Workbench. There we go. Build. Put that down right there. And then craft. We need some more straw rope. So let's batch craft two of those. Perfect. And then the stone hoe. Stone pick. I just need two more stone for that. And... So, open. There we go. Haha. -ha. Then we'll craft that too. And I don't need a wooden stick, I don't think. But I do need two more of those. Craft one of those spears. So we'll move that there, that there. We have an acorn. We're wearing armor. And I get to talk to this guy. Tootie Gong. Wow, this outfit is really powerful and handsome. With this armor, we can conveniently solve a problem. What problem? There is a force in this place called the Yaler Sect. They are notorious for evil deeds and wickedness, it seems. Like they have noticed our arrival here and sent someone. We, If we are discovered, they will definitely capture us. Leave it to me. Then we'll split up and take action. You handle the Yer cult and I'll gather information in the nearby area. By the way, here's a little trick for you. If you get thirsty on the way, you can drink. Uh, you can use it to carry water and drink. Cool. So I got a um, pot. Wonderful. Uh, now where? Where's the bad guy? Go this way. Okay, pick up all this stuff. And all this stuff. And all this stuff. Get a couple more of these. This is a peaceful little game. I think it's based off of like a Taoist uh, mindset which is super cool. I think Tau is very interesting. Um, now what? I don't want that. I want to harvest. Did that give me anything? Nope. Nope, don't need that. I don't need that. I need to craft one of these, which means I need one of these. Okay, and then I gotta stop clicking out of the menu like a noob. Okay, we'll grab this and put it there. And then we'll open B and move all the unimportant stuff, or seemingly unimportant stuff there. Um, let me close that bag, actually. I need one more straw rope to craft a hammer. At the workbench. My bad. Run over to the workbench. And open. And craft. So now I can build. Uh, like buildings and stuff. Sweet. Let's collect all the pieces that we're. Short on. Give me the daikon. Looks like charcoal. Sweet action. This is all, um, quite entertaining. Oh, let's get a drink. And... There's supposed to be a... An enemy nearby? Is that right? Can I run up the side of the mountain? I can. Be careful, you're currently in the fog. Your visibility is poor in the fog, and it can cause your equipment to deteriorate faster. Be careful of the hostile creatures in the mist. They will continuously attack you relying by relying on the mist. However, misfortune and fortune are closely intertwined. As long as you can solve the troubles caused by the fog, these areas usually carry richer harvests. So. All right. Let's 
Let's get into this and see what the hell's up here. We got to also build our own little shelter. So, yeah, this game has me kind of confused. But, I mean, I suppose it somewhat makes sense. Runic Sage Stone. Requires chill physique. Uh, okay. And I imagine if we stay out of the fog, we'll be fine. At least I would hope so. Grab this, grab this, grab this. And then we can eat. Eat another one. What is this? Nutrition. Jeez, this game is um, going to be quite extensive, I have a feeling. I hear the chickens, whatever the hell they're called. Get more radishes since that didn't give us almost any nutrition. No, 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 no. Oh. Give me radishes. There we go. Giving me a little bit of hydration, a little bit of thirst. Or a little bit of uh, stagey. And... Is the enemy in the mist? Who was that? <laughs> oh, shit. And their action skills, too. That is fantastic. I love a good game that knows how to properly execute um, action skills. Now, okay, fine. We'll do some building and then run off to save the day. Um, and I guess we'll build right over here. We'll do this, and that's X. Then that we need... Foundation, build, one, two, <laughs> three, four, five, six. Uh, I guess that was all I could build. That all, oh, that's all the wood I had. Okay. Um, now we need to consider walls. We need a lot more wood. So I'll harvest a bunch of wood. Come on. Cool. Apparently my spirit uh, also... Dude, this game is going to be like over the top kind of cool with the way it does um, stats. And I've got to get better at playing it. So... We'll have to find a way to test if we actually get more materials for, um, like, critting on a tree. Okay, and pick up all that. Uh, the stone axe broke. Oh, no. No, wrong friggin' menu. Give me that batch craft. All two of them that we can. Craft a stone axe. And then open up my bag. Throw that in there, this in there. Flint, twigs, charcoal, and what are these? Radish seeds. Cool. That leads me to the next question. A stone hoe. Um... Let's get the walls up really quick and go from there. Nope, still the wrong damn button, dude. Um, need to do... It wouldn't... Requires ham... Oh, oh, sorry. Jeez, I didn't realize I had to have the hammer in my hand. 
build. Okay, and then how do we? Uh, I just want to rotate it. Ah, there we go. And then a wooden door requires some straw rope and some stone or wood. Uh, I guess I'm going to harvest some trees really quick. I'll be right back with you. All right. So now we just need to build the basic stuff. We need to craft as many ropes as we can, which will allow us to in turn build. Um, why, 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 why you not work like that? Okay. We good. We good. We good. Um, then we can get the wooden wall and rotate it. There's that. There's that. That. And last one there. And then the thatch roof. Uh, requires us to get a lot more rush, so I'm gonna get some more rush. Alright, but that does confirm it to me that the, um, the using the knife on the rush gives you way more. No, go away, damn it. I just want to do a normal thatch row. Uh, that no I want to do a corner thatch roof convex small thatch roof convex there we go so we can do something like this And then we just need what the two sides? Patch roof, flat small, patch roof convex. Um this one? Maybe. Uh yeah, okay. Oh, nope, that's it. And then let's grab a straw bedroll. Row one. How do I? I want to build the straw bedroll, but I want to make sure that it's slapped down on the inside, not on the I want to... Oh. <laughs> Toggle indoor, outdoor. My bad. My bad. Was not paying complete attention. There. And now we need to do one of these looms. Uh, which... Woo. Didn't need to do that. Uh, let's get a few more... Rush. If we can find some. There's some over here. There we go. It's probably going to break my knife here in a second. And I'm low on the food. Well, let's cook some stuff then. But I'll break my knife first. And I think we've got plenty to cook. But I'm gonna have to double check. What the hell is this dragon whale thing up in the sky? No, I'm not just noticing it. Yes, I'm just saying it for the first time. Okay. Um, fuel remaining. So let's cook up all of those. And while that's going, we'll craft up another one of these. And then put that away too. Put in another piece of chicken. And we'll eat this and if you notice down here it gives us nutrition so it's going to 
refill our satiety, our hit points, and other things as it transforms. Um, or as it turns into um, actual nutrients. So, that gives me negative 7 chi. Uh, this gives me 0 chi, and that just allows me to plant new oak trees. So, pick up that. And go here. No, oh. No, 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 you cow. Eat. Chi of barbecue. Plus two. I love it. I love it, but that's going to be... Oh, I need to fill this up. That's going to be where we call it today. If you enjoyed the content, you know exactly what to do. Thank you very much to my patrons for your support in... Uh, getting me the necessary spiritual help to well get to this point but i won't keep you any longer thank you very much for watching and liking and i'll see you in the next one